guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a what's in my purse video. And I know that these videos were really popular way back when, and they're maybe not so popular now, but you know what? I still wanna show you what's in my purse, so I'm gonna show you what's in my purse. But first things first, my purse is from Lucky, and I really like the color of it. This navy color is just, I don't know, you don't see purses this color that often, and I think it's a, it's unique, and I really like the draw drawstring on it. It's just really convenient and easy to open and close. And then I like this little braid that it has right here. Mm -hmm. So yeah, this one's from Lucky. And I will show you guys what I have inside. So first thing that I have here is this little makeup bag. And I actually got this from Birchbox a while back. It was the first time I ever got a product from Birchbox. And it was, if you buy a full size product, you got this free bag. And I have to be completely honest with you, I bought the product because I wanted this bag so much because I just love, I just love it. I love the pattern on it. So inside this little guy, I have a EOS, or EOS, however you want to call it, hand cream. So it is, I, th I wanna say this is cucumber, yeah. Like honey cucumber. I love having hand, hand cream in my bag at all times because my cuticles get really dry. Like I really, really dry cuticles. So hand lotion is a must for me. I have another hand lotion in here too. This is an H2O targeted care hand and nail cream. I never really use this one, probably because I love the smell of this one so much. And why do I have two hand creams in my purse? I don't know. I also have this very sexy fragrance mist in here as well. It smells so good. And very sexy is a good name for it because the smell smells sexy. And then I have this lip liner that is half bitten off because of my beautiful little fluffy child that's somewhere around here right now decided to eat half of this. But I love it so much that I don't care. It still works because he didn't eat the side that I needed. This is my favorite lip liner on the planet. It's going to be in my everyday makeup routine that's going up this weekend too, so keep your eye out for that. Then I have this lip product as well. I don't have a lot of makeup products in my purse because I don't tend to put more makeup on throughout the day. The only thing that I will reapply is lip product. And this is Red Velvet and it's just a lip butter by Revlon. It's just this like really pretty, reddish color, not super red, but like just enhances your natural lip color, which is normally the types of lip products that I gravitate towards. So that's everything that's in my small little makeup bag. And then I have this tiny little wallet that I'm gonna turn around so that you guys don't see all my credit card information. This is just like a tiny little wallet. I don't like big wallets, so I try to simplify as much as I can. So I just have a few of my credit cards up here, and then I have my driver's license in this one, and then I keep just random dollars or change in this little zip compartment here. I also have a nail polish in my purse, which is a little bit random. This is from Urban Outfitters. It's the one that I'm actually wearing right now. I saw somebody wearing this color and I was on the lookout for like a sky blue color because I just thought it was so pretty. So yeah, this one's called Blue Shark and it's from Urban Outfitters and why it's inside my purse, I'm not really sure. And then I have this pen in here. It is an OptiFlow pen from Staples. Very exciting. And I also have clear eyes. Not because I smoke, guys, because honestly I have, I wear contacts and my eyes, some of you guys have actually noticed in some of my videos, you're like, girl, what is wrong with your eyes? Do you have allergies? My contacts make my eyes so dry. So midday, usually one of my eyes, it like depends on which eye wants to be really dry that day, but one of my eyes will just be bloodshot red. And so that's where this guy comes in. Of course, I have my car keys in here and my house keys are on this. And then this keychain my mom got me from Venezuela. So I've had this on my keychain for years. I wanna say over five years, this has been with me, just crazy. And this is mace because I, you never know. You, you always need some mace on hand is what I believe and I actually really like having this, especially when I'm walking alone at night. If someone's behind me, sometimes I will even open the mace and have it prepared just in case. 
because you never know guys you have to be alert and prepared because anything can happen and then i have three pieces of random gum at the bottom of my purse which i will probably never eat these because it kind of just freaks me out that they've been we do like who knows how long these have been at the bottom of my purse and there's probably there's like sand on the pieces of gum that's that's gross i have this tag from brandy melville because i just went there recently and i got some t-shirts i love the t-shirts from brandy melville looks like i paid 14 dollars for whatever this belonged to i also have my cell phone right here which there's a little crack in it because i just dropped it the other day and it was really sad and then only the exciting stuff for the end lots of quarters and dimes and nickels and a bobby pin. That's it for what is in my purse. I hope you guys liked this video. I'm sure it changed your life and you just feel like just just a well-rounded human being now because you know what's inside of my purse. It was very important information and I will see you guys all next week. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and also make sure you guys are subscribed for more videos from me. Bye. Make sure you guys checked out my last video. It is my makeup collection and organization plus a DIY. And then in the meantime, come talk to me on Instagram and Twitter and I will see you guys in my next video this weekend. Bye.